cool. Now, the next thing I want to ask you guys about this really, really popped up on the burn paper that really caught my interest. You had a section called the strategic Ethereum allocation for Tynex purchase. Can you please explain uh, your plan to support the Tynex ecosystem when, when we reach day 280? And I'll bring it up right here. Yeah, that's one of the, that's the secret, the secret sauce right there. <laughs> right here. This thing right here. This is, this thing caught my eye right off the bat right here. So you say on the 280th day, 4% of Ethereum is outclaimed to purchasing Tynex. That day would be that day set to release right, right around 11 trillion Titan X. Titan Blaze will play a crucial role, superhero, by supporting the Sableyes and the Titan X. We will join forces, actively participate in this event with enthusi in enthusiasm. So, getting into this, what we got up our sleeves, gentlemen? You got something? You're holding out on me. <laughs> yeah, interesting. <laughs> Well, we, we decided to take the Ethereum that comes in the protocol because we have this spike, you know, Mike Dean created these incredible Dune analytics, you know, and it's showing this wall, right, of Titan X coming out from on the day 280 from the launch. And, and we want to be able to help Titan X eliminate some of that supply and using Ethereum in the value of Ethereum by that time period will be substantial. So we will be able to allocate those funds to eliminate probably half of that wall that's going to come out of that tight next. And we hope some other people join in on us as well. Right. So some other things. So, so that's what that's for. Um, and then after that, the key to that, after that is the, that's going to stop, right? So that that's not going to reset. We're not going to keep adding up for the next 280 because there's not going to be another day 280 of supply release, supply release. But there will be that 4% of Ethereum that is still allocated, and that's going to go to burn tight next in place. 